at me. Okay, welcome to another edition of the Institute Lab. This time I have my trusty helper here, my son, and he's going to help us out with this last little setup. So I'm going to first show you what's going to happen. So the idea is the cart that he's holding right now is going to be moving. It's going to go through that photo gate, but this time instead of colliding with the other cart and not actually have them touching each other, the magnets are colliding and you create a close to a, an elastic collision. This time we're going to have the two carts stick together. So there's Velcro on both sides and they're actually going to stick and that Velcro is going to cause them to create what we call an inelastic collision, one where we actually keep them together. So we're going to do one trial here where he's just going to show what's going to happen. So whenever you're ready, three, two, one, go, boom. So it collides and they both go through. So that's exactly what we're going to see happen. Now this one, I'm going to want to do something different. I'm actually going to have you on the computer. You're going to be viewing the computer while this is going on, because what we should see is the momentum of this first cart come in with a certain velocity. And then since it's basically doubling its mass, because each cart has almost the same mass, we should then see each of them move off with about half of that velocity. Now we do actually have a little bit of friction, so we're not going to be perfect, but we're going to be pretty close. And since I can't actually stop it the minute we go through the photo gate first, I need to actually have you on the computer so you can kind of see those numbers happen as they are actually going. So I'm going to move over here to the computer and we're going to set this up so you can actually view velocities for each of the carts here. Move this so you can you have a view of the velocities. Move it over there. So this is our old data. What I'm going to do is let's clear this data out. So let's clear the latest run. Um, it still has these old velocities on here. That is not from our last trial, but from a different trial. So I'm going to hit the collect button. What we're going to do is we're going to watch, we're going to see a velocity 2, because that's actually the cart on the left is velocity 2, and then it, they're both going to change, so velocity 1 is going to go through and we're going to get another velocity 2 here that's going to happen. So just kind of let you know exactly what's going to happen. So go ahead and hit collect, and my helper is going to go ahead and start it, watch him launch it. So there's cart number one, and then the velocities of cart number two. 